Boston Baseball Tonight brought to you by your local Coldwell Banker Residential Brokerage Office. With Eduardo Perez and Dallas Braden, I'm Adnan Vert. Boston Red Sox right now not really showing the World Series form from a season ago, but certainly with regards to their pitching. How important is Clay Buckholz going to be when it's all said and done? He's huge. Right now he finds himself at the back end of that rotation, but he's developed that nice little cutter. He's got that big overhand curveball. We know what he's got as far as fastball below is concerned. What he needs to do is just become a little more efficient. He needs to not put guys on base. He's got to attack the zone early and often to allow his secondary pitches, which are a strong point, to go to work for him. If you can do that, they can hand it over to Uihara at the back end, and they'll be okay. And that's the, war that's the problem that I have is the bridge to get to Uihara. How is he going to be able to do so? It's going to be a tough start for him in Texas, a place that's notoriously famous more for the offense than pitching. He has to keep that ball down, has to move it in and out of the zone. If he's able to do that, he can eat up innings and then get it into the bullpen deep into. If not, it's going to be a long game and even a long season for his morale. Yeah, he's going to be that X factor, definitely. Lackey, Lester, Peavy, we know what they can do. Down the road, DeBron can be matched up in the bullpen, a guy that they can put up against a lefty. Buckholz is going to be that X factor moving forward. Buckholz, the Red Sox versus Darvish and the Rangers, among the excellent pitching matches we'll be seeing on Friday night.